hello and welcome back to the master civil engineering and in this video you will learn that how to find the included angles for a closer traverse when you know the four bearings of various lines i have been given a question which states that the following bearings were observed for a closer traverse a b c d a okay which is made up of uh, five lines a b b c c d d e and e a having the four bearings uh, shown in this table we have to calculate the included angles of this closer traverse okay first uh, bearing bearing is actually a clockwise angle measured from the reference north direction and when you are measuring this angle in the direction of the survey it's called fore bearing and when you are measuring this angle in the opposite direction of the survey it's called back bearing okay so uh, the lines and their four bearings are given in this table so we will make a rough sketch of this closer traverse since the uh, length of these lines is not given so we will make a rough sketch okay so line a b this has a four bearing of 140 degree 30 minutes okay line b c this has an four bearing of 80 degree 30 minutes line c d this has a four bearing of 340 degree line d e this has a four bearing of 290 degree 30 minutes and finally line e a this has a four bearing of 230 degree 30 minutes okay after drawing the rough sketch of this closer traverse now we will calculate the back bearing of these lines okay so uh, back bearing of a line if the four bearing of a line is less than 180 degree back bearing is equal to four bearing plus 180 degree and if the back bearing uh, if the four bearing of a line is greater than 180 degree then back bearing is equal to four bearing minus 180 degree so four bearing of line a b is 140 degree 30 minutes which is less than 180 degree so back bearing will be 180 plus 140 degree 30 minutes which is equal to 320 degree 30 minutes Four bearing of line B C is 80 degree 30 minutes again less than 180 degree so back bearing will be equal to 180 degree plus 80 degree 30 minutes which is equal to 260 degree 30 minutes okay similarly four bearing of line C D this is equal to 340 degree it is greater than 180 degree so back bearing of this line C D will be 340 degree minus 180 degree which is 160 degree four bearing of line d is 290 degree 30 minutes again greater than 180 degree so back bearing of this line will be 290 degree 30 minutes minus 180 degree which is 110 degree 30 minutes and finally four bearing of line e is 230 degree 30 minutes so back bearing will be equal to 230 degree 30 minutes minus 180 degree which is 50 degree 30 minutes okay you can see the sketch of this closer traverse showing uh, various angles that is the fore bearing and the back bearing now angle a okay so from this figure we can see that angle a this is equal to fore bearing of line a b minus back bearing of line e a okay so angle a this is equal to 140 degree 30 minutes which is the fore bearing of a b minus 50 degree 30 minutes which is the back bearing of ea so angle a is equal to 90 degree okay and angle b this is equal to four bearing of bc plus 360 degree minus back bearing of ab which is this angle okay i have shown this in the figure this is equal to 39 degree 30 minutes okay so four bearing of bc this is 80 degree 30 minutes okay plus 360 minus 320 degree 30 minutes so angle b is equal to 120 degrees okay angle c this is equal to four bearing of line this cd minus back bearing of line bc okay so four bearing of line cd this is 340 degree and back bearing of line bc this is 260 degree 30 minutes so angle c this is equal to 79 degrees 30 minutes okay angle d this is equal to four bearing of line de minus back bearing of line c d okay so this is equal to 90 degree 30 minutes minus 160 degree which is equal to 130 degree 30 minutes okay and finally angle e this is equal to four bearing of line e a minus back bearing of line d e okay 
so it's equal to 230 degree 30 minutes minus 110 degree 30 minutes which is equal to 120 degrees okay so the various included angles for this closer traverse are angle a is 90 degree angle p is 120 degree angle c is 79 degree 30 minutes angle d is uh, 130 degree 30 minutes and angle e this is equal to 120 degree okay so the best way to find the included angles for any closed traverse is that you will first draw a rough sketch of that closed traverse showing the four bearings and back bearings of uh, different lines and from that you can easily calculate the included angles okay i hope this solution video was clear and effective and you definitely learned something new if you found this video helpful you can subscribe to my channel like this video and share this video with your friends Thanks for watching Master Civil Engineering and stay tuned.